Uh, my name is Athena Wu and this is my partner Claire Crowley. We're from Loretto High School, Beaufort in Dublin and our project is about mitigating the physical harms of field hockey for outfield players. So Claire is a huge hockey player. Uh, she loves sports in general and one day she was watching rugby and she saw that they have kind of this t-shirt underneath uh, their gear that protects them from the ball and she thought uh, why can't we use this for hockey as well. Basically our aim was to create a t-shirt or some piece of gear that adequately protected the abdomen of hockey players. First we kind of researched different kinds of foams and which one would be the best contestant and the most appropriate for our t-shirt. We ultimately decided that EVA was the best candidate just because it's so cheap, so accessible, it's lightweight and also it has the shock absorbing properties that we really wanted in um, our piece of gear. We couldn't really test on an actual human because uh, that would not be allowed so we decided to use clay instead to see like kind of a visual representation of the reduced force of the hockey ball. Uh, we had two sheets of clay, one that had EVA foam um, covering it and one that didn't. We dropped the hockey ball at equal heights onto the uncovered clay and marked the indent that the hockey ball made in that clay and then we did the same with the sheet covered. The depth of the indent that the ball had made without the EVA was 0.7 millimeters and then with the A was 0.2 millimeters. And we uh, repeated this experiment twice uh, and we got pretty similar results. We showed that EVA is an adequate candidate of um, reducing the force of the hockey ball on the body and to spread awareness and start a conversation about playing safe when you're playing sport and you know, putting your body above all of other things, even though playing sport may be a huge priority for you, it's still important to take care of your health as well.